Hi, so I want to talk about new beings called Eltrons. They're more of a neutral beings. Eltrons are center-like, like half deer and half an alien-like body. Now these photos you're seeing, they're pretty much the like closest resemblance I could find online. But the beings are more like, you know, half body is more of a deer-like. The upper body, you know, like two arms and everything, but there is no face. Like, you can't really see the eyes or anything. And the whole body is not really organic. It's more of a crystallish, rocky type. There are no eyes, no nose, no ears, but... They are very telepathic, intuitive, conscious, and aware of much more than one would think. The head is kind of like triangle-ish, upside down triangle, chin is more of a square look, and they have horns that can go beyond and be like more of a tentacle, so like they have different forms, not exactly like you know stags or reindeers that you're seeing in the photos and stuff, and doesn't really go upwards, but they more like go down like hair. Now, the body has blue, green, light purple, emerald colors, you know, different beings, different colors, some of them mix, making nice designs, or you can actually literally see inside of their stomach. No guts there, that is shining, but the whole body is actually, you know, like, nice colors, and you can see, like, yellowish inside, and, you know, the body could be greenish and bluish, so, like, different colors, really. And then most of them, you know, they are working as healers, communicators, they're like massive channels of information and energy using crystals of their body like we use crystals for healing and meditations. Except they're more advanced and can reprogram the whole body and pretty much like beam it to planets, people, nature and other things. Focusing on healing, recharging energy, sharing information, one could literally contact Ultra and ask, you know, like, teach me how to time travel, teach me about some sort of events, teach me about like techniques where I could heal myself. The next thing you know, you get information out of the blue. So, you know, if the subject is known to them and the person asking for information is willing to put it to good use, they're more than willing to share it and help it. But more like, you know, if some bad guys are like, hey, Eltrons, tell me about some technology where I could kill people, they're not going to give it to you, you know? And as personalities would go, like, they're kind of like serious, stoic, wise. They value their traditions, their homeland. And, you know, like, they really don't want to go to our planets. They like their home world and, you know, they're pretty much, like, stuck there. Not, like, really stuck and can't get out. It's more like they really love it there and they don't want to go elsewhere. And they have our groups that value their jobs, like, working like super soldiers. And, you know, so basically we have other beings working and doing their own jobs. But if they get injured or anything... Pretty much like Eltrons would be the group that would focus on super soldiers or anyone like needing the help. They can actually get back their limbs or recall the like, hell beings to recall their past lives and just actually receive some intel, information, and anything you need. So there are actually lots of groups protecting Eltrons. They value their help, like their healing abilities, their information. And I was trying some things for myself, like once I found out this race, I'm like, okay, I'm sort of like seeing how they work. So I wanted to test out a few things for myself. And what I did is I pretty much tried to mess up my ability to get out of body. Why is that I can get out at night basically any time without even trying. So I have to really work hard to not get out, which means watching movies, doing bad things to myself to really block it all out. And I make a really hard intention to stay in the body, don't remember anything, don't go out and stuff. And so basically... For a few days, I was making sure, like, I watch a lot of movies. I pretty much, like, mess up my ability to get out. And then one day, like, okay, finally, no memory, no nothing. I don't get out. And next day, I pretty much, like, ask Eltrans, okay, could you help me to get out of body? Could you help me see something new, learn something new? And literally, next thing I know, I close my eyes, my physical body falls asleep. And the whole night, like, all six, seven, eight hours, all the time my physical body was asleep... I would actually wake up in an airplane and work and learn and learn new things, like see how the multiverse is working, learn about new technologies, new healing ways and stuff. Um, healing in the multiverse more like, you know, like uh, focusing on the energy work and stuff like that. So it's actually really amazing because they work. Uh, they, they are helping people to get out of body. So that's one of the things you can ask. You know, for some people, some might be interested to in getting out of body and, you know, like 
some people work their ass off really uh, they try a lot of various techniques then diets and stuff and it just doesn't work one thing you can try is to ask Eltrons to pull you out of body. Now, it's not necessarily just pulling out of body that they can do for you. You can help, like, ask them, helps to basically have more energy throughout the day, have more inspiration, feel better. They can do actual surgeries on you, making sure, like, let's say if you have any uh, actual implants or other things happening in your life, if you have been injured, Eltrons can show up and do actual surgeries and actually work on you and make sure that you get better. And you can actually as also like ask them to teach you about new subjects. For example, you might want to learn new techniques to work on yourself, maybe to remove vanities, maybe to get information, anything really. Learning blueprints, learning more technologies, becoming wiser, anything you can think of. Ask Eltrons to give you that information to guide you and these beings might help you out. So, you know, like that's that's all for now. I guess I just wanted to share this new race, Eltrons. They're pretty amazing. They're living is in this physical universe. Their world is actually really awesome. It's very much like just pretty much like just crystals, or literally. Like we watch movies and other things where you know, like people have crystals and they use them, but then we, they have these pyramids where the pyramids can actually beam out the energy and actually change the world or something like that. Eltrons are just like that. Their whole world is more of a crystallish, and so you, you can't really, you know, they don't eat, they don't have these earthly needs of eat or sex or anything. They're li literally, like, th their bodies can get out of a mountain of crystal, and they're basically duplicated by, like, making more crystals and stuff. So it's like, more like, like of a crystallish, but there's a lot of beingness within them. They have a lot of character personalities. They're very interesting, interesting beings. Um, some of them like being by themselves, you know, like they don't necessarily need a group to exist and like all this stuff, but they do value their tra traditions, their culture and stuff. So I'm just share, sh sharing this information, like uh, it's one of the beings I found recently, you know, I'm, I'm not sure you might have heard of them before, maybe some other people saw them too, but it's actually an amazing group. and. I'm sure enough that some of you can actually get really, like, you know, like, get their help more, learn more things, get better, so try it out. Like, call out to Altrans. Don't be, don't be needy or greedy, you know, like, saying, like, yeah, yeah, give me a, a million dollars. Like, no, they're not going to give you that. But ba basically, get something that would be very valuable to you or humanity, whether you're learning and getting better or whether you're going to use it for the better good they will help you get those things. Whether it is abilities, personalities, getting better, learning new things and technologies and basically getting inspired, new skills, they will literally help you with that, even if it's getting out of body. So I've tried a few things myself with them. They're actually friendly, they're willing to help. So feel free to call out and ask for their help. And at the same time, you know, be sure that you also offer them your help. And you might think like, well, I here I am stuck on planet Earth. I don't really, I can't really go there and help them. But what you can do is simply put an intention to expand your planet, make it a bit bigger, make your world bigger, make your more world nicer. You don't have to put force in anything, but just make sure like they have more place to live and exist, and that you know they don't really get attacked or anything. So you know whether you put a good intention, like even like send send them the love vibration or anything, it's all good. So you know give them something from yourself that you would like them to have, something nice. Uh, it's up to your imagination, and then also feel free to ask for their help because because they are willing to help. They you know like you can call out to them telepathically. You simply just profile like, hey Ultron, please help me get out of body. Teach me this, teach me that, and literally information will come to you. So try it out and let me know what you think. See you next time.